needs more help. If he goes to block a shot, he's got to have his teammates help him. Markel Johnson missed game one, and it's an NC State forced turnover. Long three from Beverly. Price and one. I know Beverly has range. That one might have been a little bit out of his range, about 35 feet. Rossell Hurley, the senior from Cleveland, banks it in. Long outlet to Thunderbird. Great look by Mark Kell Johnson down to Thunderbird that really got out early. And Dee McLean won't fall, but an offensive rebound again. This one from Yaya Evans. He'll take a three. Why not? In 2016, that was just his second game in his career. He scored six points. He throws one to Thunderbird who jams it. I'll tell you, the senior leader just threw a dime right there. To Vince cuts right down the lane, and he missed the lay-in. Oh, it's unfortunate. Nice play. Just couldn't finish. Another alley-oop to Bates. Good defense by Hawkins. Johnson heads the other way. Another alley. And Bates will go to the line. A lot of people are trying to knock that ball in the third row. He kept it in play and started a fast break. Price for two. They're the guys that are smart. They block it to their teammates. Here you see the pack what a off pass. and running. Wow, wow, what a pass, Markel Johnson. McLean will roll down the lane and his shot drops. Point shots, the most in NC State history through the sophomore season. And we've got another turnover. Six forced by the Wolfpack in this half. Size of the Wolfpack, the length defensively, causing all kinds of trouble in this second half. They break the pressure this time, and Nurse dunks it. They're crafty and smart, and that's what you just saw right there. Good entry pass, Daniels to Thunderbird. Where John Wall went to school, where former Wolfpacker C.J. Leslie played in high school. Let's rise to their feet as the clock hits zeros. Kevin Keats and NC State win this one in a big way, 95 to 64, the final score.